Today is August 16, 2024. Current time is 6.05 a.m. And today is travel day. So it's currently 6 o'clock in the morning and I am getting myself together. Um, we board the plane at 12 o'clock. And yeah. First ever flight. I'm a little nervous. My stomach is turning. Oh my god. Oh my god. But I'm excited for them. They don't know what's going on. Um, of course, they're going to know that they're going to get on the airplane today once we arrive to the airport. But they don't know we're getting on a boat. They don't know none of that. But yeah, I'm excited. So I'm about to go get myself together. And then I got to do one little thing before. I start getting food together. I gotta drop off my son at vacation at his school, and then we can be officially on vacation mode. But yeah, so my to do list this morning is get myself together, drop off the application, um, pack the airport snacks, and um, get them together, get them washed and dressed double check each bag make sure I got everything because I would hate to have to buy things when I get down there um, I'm just praying that my bag and my, my suitcase I only got one suitcase that got all our things in it so I'm just praying that it's not over 50 pounds I'm going to have to pay an extra hundred dollars it's going to be like I'm getting two bags check so hopefully if it's like exactly 50 pounds on a dot I'd be so happy if it's like 51 pounds I would have to take something out the number one thing I know I'm going to have to take out I don't know which way to look I'm looking at the camera and looking at over here I know the one thing I know I'm going to have to take out is the diapers and maybe the wipes and try to store it in my bag but hopefully I don't have to do that I mean if I got to do that I'll probably end up throwing the diapers and the wipes in the trash and buying diapers and wipes when we get to our location but baby girl just woke up I'll be back back so I just did I just got myself together um got the kids closed out they're still asleep and I double checked all the bags make sure everything's in there make sure our important documents make sure our boarding passes making sure our, our luggage tags um their snacks is packed as well um I'm a little nervous because their bag's not as heavy but it just looks like it's a lot of stuff in there but it's not um so hopefully when we go through TSA and all of that, everything's good on that. And um, I'm, I don't even know what time it is. I think it's exactly 7 o'clock on the dot. So I was able to get all that stuff done in like 50 minutes, which is good. Um, I double check my luggage. I added a couple more things to my luggage. <laughs> That's what I mean. I added nothing else because I'm trying to take stuff away. I'm about to brush my teeth. Um, and walk over to my son's school to drop off his papers and then email over these documents. So I shall be back. Hopefully I'll be back with the kids dress. Um, you know, give myself an hour and a half. It's gonna be about 8.30. Because I still gotta feed them. Should I cook them breakfast before I wake them up? That's a good question. Alright, I'll be back. So baby girl is currently up. We are cooking breakfast. So I'm gonna get the other kids washed and dressed. They can just eat. Yes, this is my chef stuff. Chef stuff. No, but she's a You up? You up? She's up. So yeah, it's cooking breakfast. And then we're gonna get the kids washed and dressed. So it's currently 8.09 and all the kids are up. All the kids are washed and dressed. They're eating sausages because they didn't want their full breakfast. They just wanted sausages, so whatever. Let's work on me. Cut my time a little in half. Like I said, I'm going to be done at 8.30 with washing them up and getting them fed. Um, yeah, so made good on timing with that. And my hand all in the way. Made on good timing with that. I'm currently laying in bed. I should be laying in bed because I'm pretty sure there's something that needs to be done. I gotta take this bonnet off my head. Um, um, like my nails, 
These are pretzel nails. I did them last night before I went to bed. Um, this is the brand Kiss and the Classy. This pack was $8.99 plus tax. All together, I paid, I think, $9.71. So $9 nails. Both hands. They came out actually nice. I didn't think they were gonna come out this nice, but yeah. And then I got my toes done at the salon. A gel. Pedicure it was $40. So yeah. Nails on my feet then for $49. <laughs> then I got um some eyelash clusters in. I've got these ones from Timu. Would you be surprised? I got these from Timu. They got little flaws because um I was like I did these last night as well. I did these before I did my nails, but I was so tired. Like yesterday gave me a run for my money at work. But yeah. Mm -hmm. Did my lashes. Um eye clusters. I got me some strip lashes and my suitcase with some glue just in case these fall off. Cause these not I ain't I they they can last. They can, but I always take it off by day two. I just be like wanted to rub my eyes and shit. And then once I rub my eye one falls off and it's just like girl just take the whole set off i don't see how people i mean they pay a lot of money so yeah i see like once i see one eyelash fall off they all coming out because i feel like it's, it's gonna be a, a huge gap it's probably don't be just be in my head but i feel like it's a huge gap so we just like just take them all off so i got me some strip lashes that i'm gonna throw on if i need to hopefully these last by the captain's ball that way I don't even care about no motherfucking lashes at this point. And I'm be wearing my glasses all the time, so you probably can't even tell that I even got these on. So, yeah. So, like I said, I'm relaxing. Um, it's probably like 8.15, almost 8.15. Um, we're going to leave at like 9.30, probably 9.45. Because we like, I ain't going to say we're close to the airport, but we're close to the airport. And we're going to... Catch an Uber to the airport. So yeah, the kids think they are washing dress for school. They don't know what's going on. So like I said, once we get to the airport, they probably gonna figure it out. But then again, they probably won't even know that that's the airport. <laughs> but they gonna figure it out once they see like we got luggages and shit. So I'm excited for that. But yeah, so that's about it. Stay tuned for us leaving to head to the airport. Hockey. Oh what you want? Can anyone, can anyone help me? Can anyone help me? What you want? I don't like this. This is way too close and it's pretty loud. Mm -hmm. I'm just stuck. <laughs> oh, no. Right, so we currently made it to the airport. Made it through TSA. Of course, they figured out that they're getting on an airplane. This one is sleepy, but she's been fighting her sleep. Sleepy? These kids already got me going crazy. Too much. Too, too much. Right? Right, Lee? Made it to the hotel, so I'm about to give y'all a room tour. We're staying at Cocoa Beach Suites. Yes, yeah, so we got a king size room. This is the living room area. We got the couch, some end tables, another table over here, the TV. Nice little TV. Then we got the kitchenette area. Comes with a microwave, a refrigerator. I really ain't looked through nothing yet. This is what I'm seeing. So I wasn't recording that whole time, so I'm gonna give you the room tour. Um, we got two side tables, one with a lamp on there, 
This is the king size bed. We supposed to be getting a crib for baby girl, but I ain't really like, I ain't gonna really press the issue if we don't get the crib, because the crib is free anyway. It's the TV. Um, this remote battery is dead. Um, so we we'll probably be tagging along. Well, not necessarily, because we all can be in here watching TV. This is our view alongside with the, I don't know if you can see the water, but yeah. Um, we are located right behind a Waffle House and a Taco Bell. I'm excited because I love Waffle House. I couldn't wait to get to Waffle House. And Taco Bell is my favorite, so we're just meant to be. This is the bathroom. We got tub, toilet, sink, and with a blow dryer, the mirror. Why is my flash on? I don't know. It's just not coming together. Hold on. I'm but we back. No flash. I don't know why my flash is on, but yeah. So this is the bathroom. I'm not really like stoked about that, but we just for one night, so I'm excited. We're finally on vacation. I'm excited. This is my airport fit. Little little lounge thing. Lang, 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 lang. Um it's the kids in here snacking. Y'all snacking? They were trying to eat the snack the whole time, but they fell asleep on the plane. My daughter, you excited? Excited! Hubby, you excited? He was a little play to the, uh, afraid of the plane, but he got over it because he wanted to sleep. Me, on the other hand, I was afraid too. I ain't even gonna lie. Like, it wasn't that much turbulence, and I was surprised. Like, it was just like once she felt the turbulence, it was over. Like, it wasn't that bad. Landing was okay. I was just praying for a seat. Awesome. Let me turn it this way so it gives me a better view. But it was awesome. I ain't gonna lie, I was afraid. Like I was just like, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. And it's hard for me to go to I can't go to sleep on a plane and a car if it's a long drive. I just cannot do it. No matter how many times I close my I probably did those off, but it's only for a second. But other than that, baby girl was asleep. Raya was asleep. You're gonna see the clips in the previous um you're gonna see the video in the previous clip. But yeah, other than that, I'm so glad we made it safe. I'm about to go make a couple of phone calls because we here. We finally on vacation. Let the turn up begin. I'm trying to see if I can find me a bottle of wine that I can sip tonight because maybe that's when the beverages start happening tomorrow. All right, I'll call y'all So we're back in the room. I left my phone on the charger, so I didn't record us walking down a couple of blocks. We stopped at McDonald's, got to get something to eat. Even though they wasn't really hungry, but... It's best to get something to eat early, so they they when they're playing around right now. But once they yeah, like six o'clock, so that's a good time. We'll go to bed by eight eight thirty. We gotta get up early. Um, make sure I got everything together so we can board this boat. Our check out check in time for the boat is ten to ten thirty, and um. Yeah, our check-in time is from 10 to 10.30, and we don't get into our rooms until 1 o'clock, I think, but it gives enough time to walk around the boat and get crazy. Walk around the boat and grab something to eat then and, like, let the kids have fun. Yeah. You excited? Yeah! Yeah! But, yeah. Be quiet. Um, have you, have you I'm about to play, uh, uh, Bye, Ryan. Huh? Bye. Okay, finish playing in there. I'm gonna get a pool, too. Can you go finish playing in there? Um, excuse me. I don't get my phone back. All right, go ahead. Go play. Go finish playing before I make y'all later. But, um, yeah. I'm about to play a game with, um, I gotta see how many cards is in here because I don't think it says how many cards is in here. So I'm gonna play this game with the matching game. Depending on how many cards it is, depend on if I'm playing one on one or one on one on one. That makes sense. Baby girl, I don't even want her to get into it because she's gonna mess up the cards. But that's what we're gonna do. They are running around right now, going crazy, getting my nerves, and then I'm going to. And the baby joining them too. But yeah, so I'm just gonna chill with them. Um, play this game and then make them go to bed. We're gonna try to be in bed by 9 o'clock. So yeah. And I also got me some adult beverages. Drink responsibly. 21 and older. But yeah, I got me a couple of things. Um, yeah, that's how I'm gonna end my night. I just had some Taco Bell. I don't know why I did that, but I ain't had Taco Bell in so long. It was right in front of our hotel. And the Waffle House is too, so I can't wait to wake up tomorrow morning for breakfast. I'm just gonna get a waffle though.
I'm going to do what we do. I, I think they got, I don't think they got turkey and beef. Bye, turkey and beef um, portion. So, yeah. It's going to be a waffle for me. And that's all I want because their waffles are so delicious. Other than that, play this game. Hopefully, you'll find a movie on TV. And take it down. Alright, I'll catch y'all in the next vlog. Um, that will be us boarding the boat and the sailaway party and all the other stuff. So hopefully tomorrow goes good, smoothly. The documents are okay. The letter is okay. Like everything is perfect. So we shall see. And I'll see you in the next vlog. See you nation. Bye. So this is the matching game. You just turn it over. You got to pick. And if it's not the same thing, you turn it back over. Clearly, I'm going to do it one by one. And then I'm going to try to do one by one by one. But we got to get this game started. Habib, you going to go first? Yeah. We're playing a matching game, okay? okay? I'm going to show you how to do it. So, look. Mommy, go first. S square and black pentagon. That's wrong. All right, you pick a card. All right, try to find a matching one. No, you got to flip it over. Flip it over. Go ahead. All right, nope. All right, this is round two. I beat against Daisy. This is with Ryan now. Go ahead. I got a rumbus and a circle. Go ahead, Ryan. Once you touch it, you got to turn it over. Get another one. Nope, put it back. Turn the other one back over. 